Such good weight. Damn. Hey, 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 this one, this one, this one. Oh, that's a good one. Well, you can, you can probably get this one. What is up, little... everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Humbug Outdoors Fishing. It's your boy C. Smith here, and today we are out at Folsom Lake. Uh, I'm out with some buddies. That is Preston, Austin, that is his boat, and Tommy. So we're out trolling. They just stocked it. Uh, last Saturday. Last Saturday, um, they stocked Folsom with a bunch of kings. Um, so they've already been out. Uh, they went out last week and whacked them. So they were nice enough to take me out this week and um, hopefully we're gonna catch some fish. So stay tuned, hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's see skinny. what the deal is here. We're doing one half sharp true, half silver. We're gonna put a little bit of um, a little bit of rooster tail scent spray on it. A little trout kokanee action. No kokanee in Folsom, but it'll still work for kings. Uh, we're doing this one naked, which is just zero dodger. The one to our left is gonna have a dodger on it, just to see which one goes a little bit better. We're marking fish right now at about 100 feet. We're going to be a little bit above them just so we can get on top. Um, since it is a little bit sunny today, the Dodger is probably going to be the one that's going to get the majority of the hits. It's going to give a little bit more shine view with those bait fish down there. And then we're just going to attach it to the downrigger. We're going to stagger them a little bit just so we can get a little bit different presentation. Put these back about 30 feet. We're marking another fish at about 70. Does color play a big role in this kind of stuff or? Um, it depends on the visibility out here. So today is a pretty sunny day. So we're probably going to be looking more of a darker color. We're going to try a little bit of sharp truce just because of how far down we're going to be. Um, the next one over there has a rainbow trout color. And that was the one that got the majority of the hits last time. So this is probably going to be the hot rod today. Alrighty, well you heard it from the master here. Um, I'm gonna keep the camera on as well because I'm gonna film the other people when they're reeling in fish, but I will also have the GoPro chest cam on as well for when it's my turn to reel in one. So, chest cam going on now. Let's do this. Rods are out. Let's get them. Do they do that a lot? Like you'll yeah. see just a random bunk and then it'll be gone? Uh, yeah, I think there's a fish on. I yeah, go, fish go ahead. Too. Really? Uh, go grab it, set the hook. So you're gonna pull up? Alright, came off. No, I don't feel anything, but I also haven't reeled in one of these before. I guess, yeah, keep it steady. I don't feel anything. I think that too. Yeah, nothing. Oh, never mind. Yeehaw. Hey! Is that like is that like a really small size? You know, is it filming? Yeah. yeah. Alright guys, look at this little little nugget of a salmon right here. Now we're going to be releasing this one, but either way, that is technically my first king salmon ever. So definitely not, <laughs> not, not the biggest, but if you want to get a little shot of them. Pretty much best day at Folsom ever. Yeah. Pretty cool fish though. Yeah, they're beautiful oh. little guys. Oh, look at it. Got the free flipping. See ya, Holmes. And pull it, see if it'll come off. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Trout, trout, trout on this. There's fish, 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 fish. This one? Yeah. I think it, it came off. Yeah. When you stop reeling, that's when it off. I feel some weight. I don't know, it could be the, the flasher as well. Yeah. Or the dodger, whatever it is. But it feels like there's some weight on there. Oh yeah. Yeah, there's fish. A little bit bigger than last time. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh yeah. Get him in. Yeah. That's better size. Hey. Damn, I don't know how you guys can see that on there. That's crazy. I know, right? Like just the littlest of taps. Okay. Heck yeah, let's go. All righty, guys. There is salmon number two. This one's actually a keeper. I can't believe this is a keeper. Well, <laughs> it's bleeding out, but yeah. So, but either way, um, Beautiful everyone's fish. telling me they're really good eating. So this one's gonna be uh, really fun to bring home. If hopefully if we get a couple more too, that would be really neat. Um, yeah. Get a good little dinner. But 
super pretty on look at the, look at the colors on that right there yeah, look at the shine on that guy yeah pretty little fish right there shiny little guy yeah Alrighty, and into the uh, thing he goes. The live well. Yep, that was what I was looking for. Thank you. Yeah. Alrighty, guys, a little update for you out here. Um, it's been rough. We got two fish, well, and then one wasn't a keeper. So we just got the one in the boat right now. Um, we are kind of doing some exploring as well. You know, um, Austin's trying some new water that he hasn't tried before. Um, but. You know, either way, it is really fun out here today. Hopefully, we can catch one or two more. You know, we have had some bites. Um, but if we could end the day on, like, you know, one or two more fish, that would be really cool. Um, especially so I can get footage for you guys. But, yeah, let's see if we can get some. I saw yeah. that one. What was that on? Uh, that was... Yeah, yeah he's on. Oh, that's a good one. Up, up, this way, this way, this way. Oh, I got... Oh, that's a... Tank. That looks like a good nice. one. Nice. Oh, that's a good one. That's a, that's a tank. Nice fish, dog. Yeah, dude, that is. Good fish. Yeah. There we go. There you are. Just keep him there. Yeah, that's a, that's a way better picture. Nice. You want to be on two what? what? Nice what? fish, what? Preston. Oh, we got a fighter, boys. Oh, we got a fighter. That might have been that one coming out. We got a fighter. You want to search the little tail? Oh, that's another one. Up. Up, 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 up. Nice. All right. Got a bay. That's what? That's fish number three for us? Well, yeah. fish number four. Keeper number three today. Awesome. Oh, geez. Awesome. What a pretty little. Oh, let me see him right there. Pretty little. Put him in the King water. salmon. Awesome. Can get through it? Sweet. Oh. Alrighty, guys. Oh, we're, we're starting to kind of get into a little uh, little evening bite here. So, it'd be really cool if we could get one or two more fish for the day. You know kind of enough fish to, to actually have a full meal, you know. Um, so far, it's been a really fun day. So, yeah. That's, oh, oh, oh. Go, 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 go. Yeah. All right, all right. Got you. Oh, huh? Yeah, oh yeah, that, that's good weight. Damn. Oh, damn, yeah, this is. It's all right. TV, let's go. See what I told you what 20 minutes can do? Like, all right guys, so we were kind of having a rough, like, you know, three or four hours. We've gone through this one stretch and in like 25 minutes, we've picked up three fish and we've missed a couple. So, boom, let's go. There we go, guys. Yeah, that actually looks good. Little, uh, little, I keep wanting to say kokanee because this is what I think a kokanee would look like, but. Uh, Chinook salmon, right? Uh, they're technically Chinooks? Yeah. Yeah. The landlocked king Just salmon. Landlocked Chinook salmon. They're really pretty, actually. They really are. What a unique little fish. Really um, are. Woo! And they are slimy. Guys, if you guys have not caught one of these, they picking them up is the hardest challenge in the world. Like, they are so tricky. But, there we go. There's another one in the, uh, in the good well. Boom. That's a box. Box alert! Yeah, because we can launch Rattlesnake. By that black truck, oh, yeah. things were just digging. I was like, Ooh. The biggest is 13 and a half, right? Yep. Awesome. A bunch of good fish right there. Alrighty, guys. There was my, uh, actually these weren't mine. This one was mine. Uh, this one was Preston's. Uh, but these were the two biggest of the day. You know, the Kings and Folsom, they don't get too big, uh, but they do make for great table fare. And they actually put up a pretty good fight, you know, when you don't have too much weight or like, you know, the Dodgers swinging around too much. You know, you actually get some good tugs out of them. Um, but really unique, pretty fish. Um, I had actually never been trolling. I'd never been really, I've never caught a King before. So I had a bunch of firsts today, which was pretty cool. Um, yeah, overall, I mean, 
you know, awesome day. You know, I couldn't have asked for anything more. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, make sure to give it a like, comment, subscribe, share, you know, do all that stuff you're supposed to do for a YouTube video. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time on Humbug Outdoors Fishing. Yeah, yeah, yeah.